I'm in the paddock area with Gary Lewis, the trainer of Davidia Hanover. She did everything you could ask of her in her two-year-old campaign, dominating, except win the Breeders' Crown, Gary. As we take a look at things last year, going into Canada's race, and people probably are still comparing last year's Breeders' Crown and scrutinizing her three-year-old campaign. Well, there have been a lot of comparisons made and a lot of uh, question marks about her two-year-old to three-year-old season. But uh, the Breeders' Crown was the only race she lost last year as a two-year-old. And with the traveling and the multiple race tracks and the conditions, it's remarkable to win 12 out of 13. Indeed it is. As we see the break there, and a little later on, she makes a remarkable comeback in last year's race. I guess also the fact that she is still on the track this year, and you see some of the other good two-year-old fillies last year, they're not back for three-year-old campaign. Right, a great credit to her strength and greatness and durability. I believe other than Maxine Lobel, she's the only filly to come back this year as a three-year-old in the Breeders' Crown. She has won eight times this year, and it has been against stakes competition. No overnighters for her. She has faced the top challengers this year. Right. Uh, she has had a little racing luck that hasn't gone her way in a few of the big races, which hasn't allowed her to put the kind of money on her card, but she's had a very consistent and, uh, by my standards, a wonderful season again. Gary, quickly, how does things shape up tonight for Davidia and the rest of the field? Oh, well, as I've told everyone, if I had a month from now to be ready or a month ago to be ready, I'd take tonight. Good luck. And she's in great shape. Thank you. Good luck. Gary Lewis, the trainer of Davidia Hanover. Sharon?